house painting program. Mm. Later, first it started with the government constructing houses and giving the people. Mm. But then uh, it was converted into government facilitating the house building pro mm. process. That transformation took place through the principle of participatory development. Mm. So that participatory development and community development aspect it had its origins in President Park Chung He's uh, Simon Wilbong uh, program. And then later, the 100,000 housing program became the 1 million housing program. And then that became the 1.5 million housing program. So as it grew, the government did not build houses and give the people, but the government became the facilitator. For example, provision of land. A provision of loans, but people also had their part to play in the process. And then later, it became a poverty alleviation program, uh, as Honorable Speaker mentioned, the Janasavya program, mm -hmm. which is now uh, uh, called the Samurdi program. But uh, since Sri Lanka is in a bankrupt state, we have now a kind of commenced a new program, the government has commenced a new program uh, based on the real need mm -hmm. because all poverty alleviation and community enhancement programs uh, should ideally be devoid of politics and politicization. So Sri Lanka is now moving towards that objective of making uh, everything objective and not subjective. Mm -hmm.